All right, so we're on our way from the uh, visitor center at the entrance to the park. We're actually going to head all the way to the other end of the park and work our way back. And hopefully this will be one of our spots. This big, huge mountain has logs all the way up at the top because all of this used to be a riverbed. Did everybody get enough snacks? We're on the far side of the park and we're at the gift shop, so we're gonna take a look around and see what we can find for souvenirs. So, how we got these, a couple of days ago, we got these again. Our mom let us have one again. I got one too. What you looking for, Campbell? Something to spend with my $7. Something you can buy for $7? Uh -huh. Is that your birthday money? Yep. crystal growing kit in a box. So basically you can grow your own crystals. They had a fire alarm go off while we were here. They actually shut the building down for a few minutes until the fire truck can get here. But everything's okay. This is the Painted Desert Inn here at the Painted Desert National Park, part of Petrified Forest. It's my very favorite place to stop. There's even ice cream downstairs. Hey guys, yeah. do you want to get some ice cream? Yeah. Yes. What kind of ice cream did you get, Campbell? Cheesecake. Cheesecake, what about you? Mm. Peanut butter cup. Peanut butter cup. What'd you get, Dill? Rocky Road. Rocky Road? Cheers, me. I got Rocky Road too. Cheers.
So everything you see behind me here is all uh, iron oxide. It's what makes the dirt red. These mountains here are called the teepees. You can see the layers of erosion and over time it's eroded to show some of the colors of the different minerals that are in the uh, sediments. We're here at Blue Mesa and as you can tell, the ground is just covered in petrified wood shards. And this is a natural fallen petrified wood tree. Hopefully you can see this. This is a fossil, I believe, of an ammonite. It is about 600 million years old. I made a sandcastle, I love it. Even it's got a little flagpole. This is the official Blue Mesa site. Over time, the trees were covered with volcanic ash. Ash seeped into the wood and left all this beautiful petrified wood. You'd think with all these trees there'd be a lot more shade. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for joining us on our trip to the petrified forest. We hope you had as much fun as we did. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell for notifications. Bye! Bye.